SwitchBot Curtain Rod 2 Review No intelligent home is complete without self-opening curtains. In films, these automated drapes often are a sign that either the narrative is taking place in some distant time in the future, or that the main character is extremely well off. With the SwitchBot Curtain, you too can give yourself a taste of this luxury by having your curtains shut and open with the sun rising and setting or on whatever scheme you choose. If you get yourselves a SwitchBot Hub, you can even utilize your favorite virtual assistant to have the curtains open while you're still lying snugly in bed. The SwitchBot Curtain Rod has been upgraded to include two clamps connected to the main body, which can be easily attached after the first ring of your curtains. Guided by the SwitchBot app, the setup process is much more simplistic than before. We connected to the bots through Bluetooth on my cellular phone and established the open and closed positions. Once selecting open in the middle from the offered choices, we were asked to add them into a pair, thus allowing them to be opened and shut as one. Pleasantly surprised, we realized that Curtain Rod 2 opened and closed my curtains smoothly and precisely, something that was not achievable with its predecessor. You have the capability to arrange for your curtains to start automatically during designated times, with various timetables for weekdays and weekends, or you can program them to open and close with sunrise and sunset. Start to open or close them physically and the motor will spring into action and advance it further. Furthermore, you can use your app to open the curtains, plus there is a slider that allows you to partially open them. One minor critique would be that it requires a few seconds for the app to launch and then additional time for it to react, which can be quite inconvenient. If you are hoping to gain the utmost from your SwitchBot curtains, further purchases are required. With the two-button SwitchBot remote, a basic opening and closing system can be utilized, though it really should come with the SwitchBot itself. To utilize voice commands with Google Assistant, Alexa, or Siri, or to put in place automation through IFT, one needs to purchase a SwitchBot mini hub. Through Google Assistant, we had flawless experiences, this is my preferred method for operating the curtains and feels luxurious like having a digital butler draw them closed. The SwitchBot runs on a battery and can be charged through the USB-C port or via the optional SwitchBot solar panel. Plus, they can easily be attached to curtains with adhesive-backed Velcro. Clever! To make your curtains even more automated, install the SwitchBot Meter Plus to measure temperature and humidity. You will then be able to trigger your curtains to close once the meter detects it is too hot. This configuration can be set up through the SwitchBot app or IFT. The SwitchBot Curtain Rod 2, with its new and improved design, has been a much better experience for me than the original model. However, it produces a whiny sound when beginning to move. Although it's not overly loud, any motorized drape will generate some sound. The noise is distasteful to wake up to. Going from performance to silent in the settings helps slightly, however, it does not make an enormous change. The SwitchBot curtain, which comes in either white or black, is quite bulky. Although it is possible to keep it concealed behind the curtain, its light detection function, designed to open the window when sunshine is detected outdoors, it does not work for me as our drape rod is located too high above the window and blocks the sensor on its underside. Additionally, just like its predecessor, the curtain rod too does not adequately close off my curtains. There remains a tiny gap in between them where faint beams of sunlight can still be seen coming through, thus we must manually adjust it a bit each evening. The SwitchBot Curtain Rod 2 is an improvement over its predecessor and a great option for those looking for smart curtains without breaking the bank.